Hey guys, welcome back to the Crypto Connection. Today we're going to do a quick update on Algorand. It's one of the more popular coins on uh, my channel, so we're going to give you an update on that. Real quick, I want to invite you guys to jump into the Discord. Uh, this is where we talk about all the different coins you see us doing uh, price updates on this channel. Everything is well organized on the left hand side here, all the different coins we talk about, all the different progress they make. Um, so jump into the Discord right down below there. If you're into um, if you're into pricing updates on altcoins and Bitcoin, like this video, subscribe to the channel. It really helps out the algorithm, pushing me forward, getting more exposure, growing this awesome community that we have. Also, uh, I own an Italian restaurant. Uh, I attached cryptocurrency to it, and um, we also have developed our own cryptocurrency, which is used as a loyalty program for our customers. It's super innovative. Uh, super awesome. My employees use it on a regular basis for their employee meals. So check that out. Uh, you can watch the full video on the white paper. Link down in the description to see how Marcos uses crypto at its restaurant. All right, uh, let's jump into it here, see what's going on. Um, last time I did a video, I talked about um, how we were bouncing off of this line here, this line, uh, this bullish trend line. And what I did was I actually expanded this all the way out uh, so you could see back, you know, way back when that this has been a bullish trend line for years actually. And this was a uh, hyper bubble that we had in the middle of it. Okay. That's what we'll call that. We'll call that a hyper bubble there. Uh, just a big bubble that lasted about a year. And now we came back to the trend line and we're bouncing off of it again. Uh, zoom into present day though and we can really see what's going on here. Um, first and foremost, I drew this line a while ago. Uh, not a while ago, probably when I last time I did a video three days ago. Um, and this, this arrow says that we're going to be bouncing off of this bullish trend line and I still stand true to that. All right, I still believe that's going to happen. We're going to be seeing a lot of this type of action here. Okay, we're going to see a lot of this action for a little while at least because the the thing is in fact it might even dilute a little bit to where like we're not even getting as high up until we can get above the the uh, 50 day moving average right so this 50 day moving average here I kinda drew these next points uh, we'll actually extend this part of it there we go, boom, uh, up to there. I drew these so you could actually see that it's going to be a little bit of a decline because this is creating resistance, all right? We actually did close above it here on this candle on July 19th. The very next day, that on that same candle, we hit this line of resistance. The very next day, we came right down back below the 50-day moving average. Um, so our first point of resistance is the 50-day. And this is going to extend out, okay, it's going to keep pushing us down. Uh, and I see that being an issue for some extended period of time. Um, I do believe that we are overdue for a little bit of a bullish run here. Um, however, the whole market is way overdue to consolidate a little bit right where it's at. Now, while we're consolidating, it's very reasonable to see bounces to the upside, back down, all within a range here, you know, whatever that range may be, we're sort of reestablishing it now. We've been in this uh, consolidation period for about 45, 50 days now. So let's see where this consolidation period is, see where the top of it is, where the bottom of it is. Having said that, guys, that's all there is really to say about um, Algo right now. I will keep you updated on a regular basis as I see things happening. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys on the next one.